Beauty Bunnies for this week's Halloween look. This is my favorite of the two that I've done. If you haven't watched last week's, go ahead and watch that. I did a very glammed up version of Pennywise from the movie It. And for today's video, I'm doing a very pretty mermaid. Doing this look, I've never done anything like this with a whole scales and stuff. And I, I, I love, I can't stop looking at myself. I'm about to like, after I finish with this, I'll be all over Snapchat and Insta Snap because this look is just everything to me. And enough talking because this is gonna be a pretty long video. So let's jump into the tutorial. So the first thing I did, I started with primer and brows. And for primer, I use Milk of Magnesia because you want this look to last you all day or all night whenever you are going out and wearing this look. You want the look to last. You want, just in case you're like dancing and sweating or anything like that, your look doesn't sweat off with you. Now for brows, as usual, I did my black brown pencil, but as the video goes along, you'll see that I did darken them a little bit more. That's why they look so much darker now than they do in the clip that you're seeing right now. For foundation, I used my Kiss Cover Plus Care foundation in the shade Neutral Cool 20. This is a cream foundation and I did use it with my Sonia Kashuk brush and just apply that all over. After foundation, I set my entire face with my Ruby Kisses No More Blemish powder in the shade Chestnut. This you can find, both of these you can find at your local beauty supply store. This was $7.99, this was $4.99 and they get the job done. These are the same things I use for my everyday makeup looks when I'm like going to work or going on the road or whatever. This is what I do on the regular. After I set all of that with the powder, I did bake with my Ben Nye Banana Powder and then I did contour a little bit on my jawline and my forehead with my Ben Nye Ebony Powder. Now for the fun part. What I did to make these pretty little scales all over my face was take a pair of fishnet stockings, slip it over my head, got my pretty little grace pretty little pretty little miss grace palette pretty little miss grace is a fellow youtuber this palette was made with is a collab between her and sedona lace and the colors in this as soon as i thought of this look this is the palette i thought of using to make my scaly face yeah <laughs> the colors i used are the charm leafy and frost colors the three blue greens at the top here and i applied that with my elf kabuki brush now when you're doing this you don't want to swipe because you don't want to end up shifting the fishnet and then your scale just look all blurry so what i did was just pack the powder on there and then kind of just overlap so they have like a an iridescent ombre looking look at the end instead of just like one solid color i want it to look you know like i was in the ocean and the sunlight hitting me and it just you know pretty yeah as for the scales i moved on to eyes and then of course we are using the Too faced just peachy palette for this entire month and the only two shades i used actually were peach tart which is that pretty brown up there and i used peach punch all over my lid as well as under my lash line i also took peach punch around the edges of my scales i also took the pretty little miss grace the three colors that i used and brought it down on my neck a little bit on my chest and then i used the same peach punch to go around the edges of those colors so that it looks more you know it looks a little bit of red contour and then the red also ties in with the eyes so that it doesn't look too out of place now this is where i went in with my black pencil on my brows and just i just feathered in a couple of strokes with the black pencil and then took my spoolie and just blended it all out so it wasn't too stark i went on to tight line my lower lash line i then applied my lashes which are some Lux by Kiss I Envy lashes. They are 100% Virgin Remy lashes. They do have the little Swarovski rhinestone thingies on them to give it that added va va voom factor that we always try to go for with these looks. I also took rhinestones, really teeny rhinestones, which you can find in your local beauty supply store, the same place I found these lashes. 
and I applied the rhinestones, just three, one clear and two pink under, like right by each tear duct. And I applied those with clear lash glue. Actually, I did lips first before the rhinestones, so we kind of skipped a step there. But for lips, I used the Forever Matte Liquid Lipstick, and I do have a review on these lipsticks. This one is New York Pink. It is a matte. It is a pink. <laughs> it's a very like a more peachy pink than anything else and I think it will look perfect. Well I I think it looks great with this look. It kind of ties in the lips, the little edges that I did around the scales and it just made the look become one. For my mermaid top this is a custom bra that was made. I will leave my what do I call her? I will leave the designers <laughs> Instagram and info in the description bar if you guys want your own custom top mine just says kissy on the front and I do have a That was my whole palette that just fell. I pray to God it didn't break. But I do have a photo shoot with this bra. So I'll like insert some pictures so you can see what the bra actually looks like because I don't want to stand up right now. Is that lazy? But yeah, it just says my name right there kissy and yeah, it's blue and it's sparkly and I thought it went with this look. That is the end of the video. If you have any questions for me, leave them in the comment section below. If you feel like I should have mentioned something that I didn't mention, leave it in the comment section below. If you have any ideas for future videos, looks that you wanna see, leave it in the comment section below. I already have like the other two looks that I'm gonna do in my head already, like written down and everything. So yeah, um, but yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, peace sign and kissy face.